So I've seen a lot of videos where it's a prayer for the day or a verse for the day or a prayer for you or just kind words, which encourages you. I haven't seen a whole lot of videos of like actually accepting Jesus into your heart. Um, John fourteen six says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. You know, Jesus said that. And so, it's just about, you know, denying yourself, realizing that you are, you know, a sinner, you know, throwing your pride out the window and realizing that you, you need to be saved, you need help, you know. And I promise you, it's it's freeing once you give yourself to Jesus. It's so much, it's better, you know. And this is one of those things that I can talk about it all day or the other YouTubers can talk about it all day and try to persuade you and everything else. But it honestly comes down to you and your willingness and your readiness to take the step into everlasting life, you know. Have faith that Jesus is the way, the truth, the life. He said it. <laughs> He's not a liar. And uh, after that, after you accept him into your heart, you know, it's like your your eyes are opened. Like, truly, honestly, accept him into your heart. It's like you wake up and you start seeing the world for how it is. And you can actually see the evilness, the corrupt, you know, the bashing of Christianity. You know, it's not really they bash Islams or Buddhists or the Hindus. You know, it's just Christianity. And it's... You start seeing how the world is fighting so hard against the light. And it's it, it pushes you more to build that relationship with Christ. And the Bible is probably the best way to learn how to do that. And I'm still learning every day I'm still practicing every day and I still fail him every day but because of his grace and the salvation through Jesus I'm saved and another thing that I've learned recently that's kind of a big one was you know you can't you can't earn salvation like I could win the lottery and give it to all the homeless people in the world and try to get them a house and build up and work my bones to or my fingers to the bones and just break myself for other people. And if I don't have Jesus, I mean, the day of judgment, <laughs> he's going to tell me, depart from me. I never knew you. You can't earn it. You know, and that that was a big like, wow, moment, once I once it finally clicked in your head, you know. So just, you know, accept him into your heart. And then once your eyes are opened, I mean, and you know that you're saved when, when you, I know I keep repeating myself and I'm sorry. I'm not good at editing videos, so y'all have to watch my mistakes as well, and I apologize. But, uh, yeah, the relationship with Jesus is amazing. It'll turn you from life at a party, always drinking, fighting, dogging on people, you know, dancing that fine line. You think you're being funny, but you're really pissing somebody off. Yeah, once you open your eyes and you see that, you know. So, I mean, it's basically, you got to believe that Jesus did die on the cross for you, you know. And your mom, your dad, your grandparents, people next door, people over in China, he died for all of our sins. He took on all the sins, you know. And he rose again on the third day. He took our sins on himself, died, took our death 
took our place in hell, and then on the third day rose again. He did all that to purchase us, humanity, back from when Adam and Eve brought sin into the world. And just the thought of him, you know, honestly, doing that for all of us, the creator, the God of the universe, he did that for us. That's it's pretty amazing. Anyway, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.